the left-wing mainstream media are ganging up on the concerned citizens of Merseyside who are protesting against illegal migration. Okay, what's been going on in Kirkby, Merseyside is uh, still escalating. Over the last couple of days, we've had a, a series of uh, protests and uh, we have to differentiate between a, a small group of people who start riots, uh, but these are the people who start riots on anything that happens, and the rest of the people who are simply protesting and raising awareness of what's been happening. A quick um, recap in case you... I didn't follow the story from the beginning in Kirkby. This is the video that went viral of a 25-year-old illegal migrant who decided to chat up a 15-year-old girl. Didn't really go well. How old are you? 25. 25. I'm only 15. Okay, good. That's, no, that's not good. I want, I want to your no, sorry. What's up? You don't do this in this country. It's, it's you go to jail if you do this. It is, I want, I want. No, no, you're not right. No. I'm 15. No. It's absolutely weird, uh, and this, of course, the. It sparked a series of uh, protests uh, in Kirkby. But the problem we now have is that uh, the, the mainstream media are putting everybody in the same box and category. Uh, feel free to condemn uh, the, the violent and riots. But in reality, if people are turning up to protest against something, you can't really just label them things without knowing. Uh, the Guardian calling everybody far-right protesters uh, outside uh, the Merseyside Hotel, and they say they were housing asylum seekers. They they love that word. <laughs> but in reality, obviously, the illegal migrants who were housed there. Um, and again, you had Careful Calais saying the far right have split into three groups and surrounded us, surrounded us at the hotel. The police don't have the capacity to cover all three groups. Why on earth are Careful Calais are in Merseyside. What what are they doing outside that hotel? And don't tell me they're going to be some sort of vigilante group like, oh, we are here to protect the innocent uh, illegal migrants. You need to pick a side. As a charity, what is your role in this country and in France, in Calais? Literally called Care for Calais. But they can do whatever they want. They've been given a, a green pass to do whatever they want. Now, again, they've been posting updates, Care for Calais, saying a full account of tonight's far-right demonstration turned into riots. Uh, sure, as we said, they can condemn the few idiots who start riots, but the way they are changing the narrative is very technical, but it matters. When you have the BBC and the Guardian and the Care for Calais, every headline saying everybody is hard right and everybody is basically rioting, that is a lie, and that is dangerous. To the narrative that is how they did they demonize every single person in the country who is concerned about an issue and it's not the first time the communists have come out the commies and the antifa have been saying oh we are calling all the antifa <laughs> come and help us to fight back these are the people who are also causing violence why are you not telling anything and anybody about these idiots they are causing harm they are starting a physical action but apparently, it's okay. Communists are the goodies, according to the media. Let me show you one of the individuals who was at these, uh, who goes to these protests. And please tell me if this is normal behavior uh, or normal. <laughs> it's, I know it's harsh to judge people's appearances, but sometimes it's it's just a bit weird. So this this human. <laughs> I'm, I I hope she's human. I'm going to zoom in to this photo. Just look at, I'm not really judging the makeup. I'm most, <laughs> mostly judging the rest of her outfit. Um, on her chest, there is a baby. Um, <laughs> I'm not really sure why. <laughs> and under her uh, ears, so both sides, left and right, I can, s I believe they're like lollipops or something. And she is the symbol of a uh, anti hard right. I, I don't think this is normal. <laughs> That's just one, by the way. This is, the, the whole thing is just a circus full of clowns. And either clowns or actual violent commies, hard left. But no, 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 the media shouldn't really mention that. 
Don't mention the left, just mention the right. He said, because if you believe in border security and your national sovereignty, you are hard right. Dangerous. Yeah, okay. <laughs> anyway, let's take a break. I'm going to come back in half an hour. I'm Maya Tusi and we are the media.